Hello, friends. Have you ever gazed up into the night sky and wondered at the possibility of life on other planets? What marvelous beings might exist out there, hands extended in friendship, awaiting the moment when we humans take our first tentative steps into space? What tales will be told of that glorious day when we are first contacted by our brothers from beyond the stars? Systems go, General. Four. Come on, baby, show us what you got. Three. What the hell? Two. What in the blue blazes is that? One. No, wait. Stop the countdown. Incompetent fool. I should never have sent you. What's shaking, Pox? You look a little, what's the word? Constipated. <sighs> Let's just say I hope you turn out to be less of an evolutionary dead end than your predecessor. You lost me. Shall I tell you a secret? Few of our people know this. But the DNA patterns in our cloning banks are becoming more and more degraded with each new clone. That's bad, right? Only if we want to retain our immortality through cloning. Of course it's bad! I sent Crypto-136 in search of a planet we visited many eons ago. A planet seeded with pure Furon DNA. But I lost contact. Let me get this straight. You sent me, uh, him. Crypto-136 to a hostile planet, and he's disappeared. Maybe captured, maybe even being tortured as we speak. Well, I wouldn't jump to any conclusion. I bet you wouldn't. Let me tell you something, Pox. You're a smart cookie. But there's a time for thought, and there's a time for action. And this is one of those times. Which? The second one. Perhaps you're right, 137. Of course I'm right. You kidding me? A cryptosporidium captured by a bunch of monkeys? We gotta go in. We gotta crack some craniums. We gotta rescue me. Him. He's gotta rescue me. I mean, we gotta... I gotta... Brains, man. When do I get to blow things up? Patience, Crypto. Patience. I take your point. Prepare the mothership. That's what I'm talking about. So, what's the name of this crummy planet? Our destination. The planet Earth.
Ortho box to Crypto Sporidium 137. Come in, Crypto Sporidium. Crypto here. How's the view from the safety of the mothership? Very funny. Let's just say I'm glad I'm up here and you're down there. Loathsome little planet. Now, Crypto! To ensure this invasion runs smoothly, it is imperative we identify the dominant life forms on this world. Those lactating bovoids are likely candidates. Surely you don't mean those foul-smelling gas bags beyond the fence? Yes, I'm afraid I do. But they're covered in nipples. Now, Cryptosporidium! Crypto, do verify your suit is working under Earth's atmospheric conditions. Get a move on! We can peer into the minds of lower life forms via the Cortex Scan. Rip the preliterate thoughts from their pathetic little brains! No? Primitive, yet profound. Scan another one. Again with the moo? I think these lactating bovoids are trying to fool us. They eat with their mouths? Ugh, I think I'm going to be violently ill. Attention, Earth creatures. This planet is now part of the Furon Empire. Your benevolent masters welcome you. At this time, we wish to abduct you for the purpose of scientific research. The procedure will be protracted and invasive. Do you have any objections? Earth creature, I am addressing you. Respond or be vaporized. I don't care how many stomachs you have. I don't have time for this. We Furons have evolved the astounding power of psychokinesis crypto. Target an object or creature, then lift it into the sky. Use PK to finish off the belligerent bovines. Slam them into the ground. Curse these creatures. Good work, crypto. Mmm, Martha. You didn't tell me we was having barbecue for dinner. Wait a minute. That ain't steak. That's... Holy mother of... Martha, give me the shotgun! This looks like a job for the Zapomatic. Fry that farmer! <laughs> Extract and collect the brainstem from what's left of the agricultural engineer. You can consume the brainstem and collect the Furon DNA. Harold! Come on back! You gotta see this! They got a talking horse on the TV! I ain't never seen nothing like... Let none survive!
Evening, Ms. Turnipseed. We got a call from Farmer Dixon over the other side of the state road. Said he heard some pretty strange noises coming from over this way. Little green spaceman! What is oh, that? A new silo? Electrocuted him with a big arm! Crypto! That human law enforcement officer is attempting an unauthorized entry of your spacecraft. If those pea brains were to get their hands on your quantum deconstructor, they could rip a hole in the space-time continuum! Oh, the Furonity! Vaporize them, Crypto! Been told. I don't know, but I've been told. Joe McCarthy's good as gold. Joe McCarthy's good as gold. Oh, great. The human military industrial complex. We can't allow them to alert their leaders to our presence. Exterminate them! Now! Open fire! Crypto, I hereby give you official permission to destroy all. in the bushes. Replenish your saucer's shields by draining any human vehicle. Did you see what I saw? You bet your sweet ass I did. What did you see? 
Little green man in a flying saucer wiping out the best infantry unit in the U.S. Army. Right. Good. Me too. Green? Not gray? Don't be a stiff. You know what it means? Absolutely. What? It means the papers got it right for once. Get on the horn to silhouette. We've got the worst case scenario. The eggheads were actually onto something? I don't believe it. Believe it. Roswell was only the beginning. The invasion is on. Now then, I know what you're thinking. What can I, a lowly novice, do to help bring about the destruction of Earth and the inevitable reign of the Furon Empire? Well, I'll tell you. It was in the earliest days of the Empire we realized our species was doomed. Eons of waging war on inferior races with unregulated atomic weaponry had mutated our genes. We could not propagate due to our complete and utter lack of genitalia. Fortunately, a Furon ship happened upon Earth on its way back from destroying the Martians. Human society was young and... nubile. Sailors on a foreign planet, letting off steam, one thing led to another. Long story short, every human being alive today has buried deep in his genetic code a strand of Furon DNA. Over the eons, we've learned to clone ourselves, but with each iteration, the information degrades, and the results are increasingly unpredictable. The Furon genes in humanity's DNA are ancient, uncorrupted. They represent the future of the Furon race. If only we can get at them. Welcome to my little laboratory. You may not have known this, but I flatter myself to be something of an inventor. In my spare time, I've been developing some truly impressive weapon and ability upgrades. I'd be happy to share them with you. If you've got something for me in trade, say some of that delicious DNA you've collected. Hmm?
Crypto! I see a horde of humans up ahead, congregating at some sort of holy ground. Here's the plan. I want you to enter the fair, find a malleable human and lead it back to your ship for... questioning. Get the picture? Crypto! That human is aware of your presence. The more people become aware of you, the more chance that those human policemen and the military will come to investigate you and take you down. Don't forget to disguise yourself, Crypto. You're not exactly inconspicuous. that you're sufficiently disguised. Continue using the cortex scan to maintain the illusion. You wouldn't want to lose concentration while surrounded by enemies. Mahayan! Mahayan! Crypto, how are we going to find information if you kill important people? Get back to the mothership! Crypto! That human is aware of your presence. The more people become aware of you, the more chance that those human policemen and the military will come to investigate you and take you... Don't forget to disguise yourself, Crypto. Now that you're sufficiently disguised, continue using the cortex scan to maintain the illusion. You wouldn't want to lose concentration while surrounded by enemies. What would Elliot Ness do? Never carry a knife to a gunfight? No, that's not it. What was it again? Talking horse on TV's what we there. need is the Get dumbest, here, weakest Tom. willed, most Imagine malleable human we can find. Admittedly, the competition will be fierce. You just have to scan them all. Ooh, there it is again. That not so fast. Man, oh man, she may be the dumbest Miss Rockwell ever. And check out them cantaloupes. <laughs> God, I love America. This human seems to be onto something. Will wonders never cease. Keep scanning the humans. About little green men in a flying saucer landing in their pasture and blowing up all the cows. If only I could confess my secret love for Joe Bob. Joe Bob the chicken, that is. Damn, I love that animal. Man, oh man, she may be the dumbest Miss Rockwell ever. And check out them cantaloupes. <laughs> God, I love America. I want to marry Miss Rockwell, but instead I gotta sit here hour after hour, day after day, watching this dying wheel go up and down, round and round, over and over again until somebody dies. Hell of a metaphor. Yes, yes! Like proteins from the primordial ooze, a pattern is emerging. Scan some more human minds, Crypto! Would it kill her to use tofu? Oh, wait, uh, tofu? What the heck kind of thinking is that? Meat, meat! I like meat! Yeah, 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 town's doing great, business is booming, hope is on the way, yada, yada, yada. Let's uh, barrel through this puppy so I can get down to the real business of governing. Making time with the delicious Miss Rockwell. I don't know what that Johnny was sowing, but I don't think it was apple seeds. <laughs> Man, am I buff. Beat that, Charles Atlas.
I gotta find me a policeman, then a construction worker, and then maybe an Indian. I'd make me a barbershop quartet like no other. I'm queen. Finally, I was gonna flip my lid if Mama made me take one more slurp of cabbage soup. I want roast chicken. Mmm, chicken of the sea. Or was it by the sea? All right, Crypto. I have analyzed all the thoughts you've collected, and I think I've isolated the perfect subject for you to... Probe and vaporize? No. Abduct and bring back to the mothership. My way's more fun. Abduct, not vaporize. Okay, but humanity ain't gonna annihilate itself, all I'm saying. Can I finish? Can I stop you? As I was saying, the newly crowned Miss Rockwell looks like a prime candidate for testing. She's envied and desired by other humans. She's highly persuadable. Best of all, she apparently has a brain the size of a peanut. Hypnotize her and send her back to your ship for collection. Implant a command on a puny human brain. Bend its will to ours. I want to thank all the little people, but there's no time. Gotta go! Aliens in the cornfield? I knew I should have built that baseball diamond. Which way's the exit? Enjoy the fair! Oh, and don't ride the mangler! It's a freaking death trap! Must keep going. Feet well, really killing me. Direct. Damn direct heels. Is, uh, from one fear to the next. Wait! I left I'll my purse in the tent. I must go to the dark and mysterious woods. There's no reason to be afraid. Nothing bad ever happens to people who go into dark and mysterious woods. Especially not in fairy tales or slasher films. Not that I know what those are. Nope, nothing to worry about here. Crypto, what are you doing? Get back in range! In here. Of course, I can't ever remember where I parked. My car seems bigger and rounder and saucer shaped. Whoa, this is just like my dream. Can't wait to tell Dr. Freeman about this. La 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 And lots of wavy hair like Libera Wait a minute Where am I? This sure doesn't look like the pie eating contest Uh oh Uh oh What's happening? Oh god please no It's probing time. Oh, yeah, right there. That's the spot. Oh, that is delicious. Never fails. Hurry, Crypto! The authorities are on their way! Get in your saucer! Wreak havoc by using your saucer's abducto beam to levitate a creature or object.
A saucer upgrade, perhaps? No? How about your gun? Or your abilities? Hmm? Crypto! Those nearby bovoids appear to have been genetically manipulated by the humans. But for what purpose? I want you to investigate this bizarre mutated species. these pathetic gas bags and turn them into radioactive exploding zombie cows! Show them the folly of their mad science! Looks like I picked the wrong one. Drop your weapon! Let's get it! 
Alpha male? Where did he come from? Never mind that! You must stop him before he publicly reveals your existence. Go to this town hall and take the alpha male's place to address the pea-brained masses! Restricted area. How droll. Crypto, the charming security at this town hall won't let you in without a jacket. Use Hollow Bob to keep standards up, will you? Martha! Martha, get me the shotgun! I gotta kill me a varmint! Huh. Maybe it was that radio station that comes in through my feelings. No, Crypto! Now the humans know you're here! Back to the mothership with you! The town's alpha male? Where did he come from? Never mind that! You must stop him before he publicly reveals your existence! Go to this town hall and take the alpha male's place to address the pea-brained masses! Do this! No, Crypto! Now the humans know you're here! Back to the mothership with you! Alpha male? Where did he come from? Never mind that! You must stop him before he publicly reveals your existence. Go to this town hall and take the alpha male's place to address the pea-brained masses! A restricted area. How droll. Crypto, the charming security at this town hall won't let you in without a jacket. Use Hollow Bob to keep standards up, will you? is already in progress, but before we do to these pitchfork connoisseurs, we need- No, Crypto! Now the humans know you're here! Back to the mothership with you!
Crypto! The gathering is already in progress. But before we deal with these pitchfork connoisseurs, we need to find the alpha male. It's him! The mayor! Now use Hypnoblast to distract the lackeys surrounding him. What's going on there? Come out with Mayors and children. Bow down rest. before me. Drop it. No, Crypto. Now the humans know you're here. Back to the mothership with you. Crypto. The gathering is already in progress. But before we deal with these pitchfork connoisseurs, we need to find the alpha male. It's him! The mayor! Now use Hypnoblast to distract the lackeys surrounding him. I want to ride a motorcycle. How come I never get to ride a motorcycle? Man, am I crooked. I just ru- Keep it together, man. Keep it together. Evildoers are everywhere. Move along! Nothing to see here. Oh, I sure like saying that. Where is the police commissioner? He was assigned to protect me. Time to take the stage. Break a leg, Mayor Crypto. Assure them that everything is normal. No mon Only monkey business as usual. Every one of the dang cows, then it'll look like it stuck some sort of device up the poor thing's- Crap, crap, and after all that, I didn't even get to see Miss Rockwell. She just walked right on by with her- Crops laid out flat in circles like a 4th of July pinwheel. I told Edgar, there goes our savings, no new shoes for the twins, and I guess Darlene's just gonna have to live another year with that overbite. Greetings, fellow human agricultural engineers. There is nothing going on here. Everything is normal. Carry on with your pathetic human lives. That is all. Now wait just a cotton picking minute. Mr. Mayor, I've lived in this town all my life, and I voted for you twice in the last election. Now I'm entitled to a god darn answer. If they ain't nothing going on here, how come all my cows is glowing like lightning bugs? What you say to that, whipper snapper? That? Well, that's just the uh, healthy inner glow that comes from chewing a, a cud of fresh green Rockwell grass. Why, I uh, chew it myself all the time. Got some in my craw right now. Better than snuff. You want to know what's been going on around here? I'll tell you what's been going on around here. Communism, that's what. I don't know about you, but I'm not willing to see the land our forefathers fought and died for fall under the boot of the creeping red menace. Not on my watch. You've been a great audience. 
Don't forget to tip the veal and try the waitresses. And if you liked what you heard, throw me a bone and vote for me next election day. Early and often. Wait just a second. How in the world does any of that explain the destruction at the fair? Don't you read the papers? That the cluster point was a tragic confluence of the summer lightning and the tent slathered in creosote. That's my story and I'm sticking to it. Now hold on! How come nobody in Santa Modeste has been seeing anything like this? Santa Modesta is experiencing exactly the same problems we are. The difference is we have that award-winning city desk over at the Rockwell Gazette, and nothing gets past those guys. They keep me honest. That ain't the mayor. It's an alien from outer space. Well, he does look a little bit like Michael Rennie. Every one of the dang cows, and then it looked like it stuck some sort of device up the poor th That? Well, that's just the uh, healthy inner glow that comes from chewing a, a cud of fresh green Rockwell grass. Why, I uh, chew it myself all the time. Got some in my craw right now. Better than snuff. You want to know what's been going on around here? I'll tell you what's been going on around here. Communism, that's what! Well, I don't know about you, but I'm not willing to see the land our forefathers fought and died for fall under the boot of the creeping red menace. Not on my watch! So, uh, the next time you see a strange light moving and changing direction at incredible speed in the night sky, you would just think to yourself, no commie's gonna distract me from my patriotic duty with a couple of bottle rockets. No, sir. Now, wait just a second. How in the world does any of that explain the destruction at the fair? Read my lips. I will not rest until we find the perpetrators of the fairground carnage and uh, bring him to justice. Well now, hold on. How come nobody in Santa Modeste has been seeing anything like this? How the hell should I know? So, as you can see, there's nothing to trouble your puny human brains about. The mayor's right. This was all just a random series of suspiciously coincidental yet easily rationalized events. Yeah, that's right. Give it up. Let's hear it for me. Suckers. Good night and uh, have a pleasant tomorrow. What a bunch of losers. 
Mine's like mud. This planet is easy pickings. Crypto, did you hear what that human said during your speech? Must have missed it. Busy digging on the love. Focus! There's another human hive nearby. Santa Modesta, he called it. You must discover its location and make your way there. We've got more humans to control! Did you want a saucer upgrade? Or something a little more... personal? Thank you. 